In today's video, we're going to look at part to whole ratios, where one side of the ratio represents the total or whole. For example, in this one here, we're told that Charlie collects both blue and green cats, so that the ratio of blue cats to the total number of cats is 3 to 7. And the question then is that if she has 12 blue cats, how many green cats must she have? Feel free to pause the video here and have a think. Now, there's a couple of different ways that you could do a question like this. But the way that I would do it is to start by trying to work out the ratio of blue cats to green cats. As the question tells us that the ratio of blue cats to total cats is 3 to 7, that means that for every 7 cats she has, only 3 of them are blue, which means that the other 4 must be green. So we know that for every three blue cats, there are four green cats. Or in other words, the ratio between them is three to four. Now that we've found the ratio of blue to green cats, we just need to scale up our ratio to find out how many green ones there must be if there are 12 blue ones. So for this, we just place the 12 beneath the three because this left side of our ratio refers to blue cats and then think of what we have to multiply 3 by to get to 12, which would be 4. So we also have to multiply our right-hand side of 4 by 4 as well to get 16. So we now know that if she has 12 blue cats, she must have 16 green cats. Or in other words, way too many cats. Let's try one more. Imagine that you have a box of orange and purple beads, and that the ratio of orange beads to total beads is 4 to 9. If there are 28 orange beads, how many purple beads are there? So like before, the first thing we want to do is find out the ratio of orange beads to purple beads. And because we have 9 beads in total, and only 4 of them are orange, we know that five of them must be purple. And the way you could work that out in the exam is to do nine minus four to get five. So our ratio of orange to purple beads is four to five. Then because the question tells us that we have 28 orange beads, we can place the 28 underneath the four and figure out that it's been scaled up by a factor of seven which means that we also need to multiply the 5 by 7 to find out that there must be 35 purple beads. Anyway, that's everything for this video. So, hope you found it useful, and cheers for watching!